and welcome to another episode of It's Tipped Up Fishing. My name is Keaton Disfield and this is Wesley Francis from Carpe Diem. I've got an expert on bait boats with us for a good reason today. We're doing a full review on the deeper range extender kit. Now we're going to get into what it is and all that stuff now now but before we do that there is a discount code that you guys can get a discount on deeper products at the end of the video so keep watching and make sure to check that out. But for now the Deeper Range Extender Kit. Let's get to it. Firstly, your Deeper Range Extender Kit comes with a dual mount which mounts to your tripod and holds both your included range extender and your cell phone. It uses a quarter 20 screw mount. Forgive my cracked screen cover, my phone has got a really tough life. Once you have mounted your phone and extender, we can move to your bait boat. Clean off your mounting point and stick on your heavy duty Velcro stick on then give it at least 24 hours to properly stick to your bait boat. Once that's done, grab your deeper which is not included and mount it inside your bait boat arm, which is included. The mount securely screws into your deeper and both floats and extends to properly fit the height of any bait boat. Then as a failsafe, deeper has included a safety lanyard that attaches to the top of your deeper. Then take the other end of the lanyard and attach it to your boat, so that if your mount ever separates from your boat, you still can tow your deeper home safely. Then press your bait boat arm to the bait boat's velcro and extend your arm to the correct height. You want your deeper to face directly down, any other angle can give you false results. Then place your bait boat and your deeper into the water to turn on your deeper. Keep it within 5 meters of your charged range extender and press the on button once to connect your extender to your deeper. Then connect your phone to the range extender and you're off to the races. Provided your range extender is 1.2 to 1.5 meters off the ground, your range extender should give you 200 meters of uninterrupted signal to your deeper. Okay, so we've got the deeper range extender right here. Wonderful. So testing this thing with this guy over here was 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 quite an experience because he's like yeah, let's test it with this and what about that and what if you're driving in this way with that and we fully tested this thing and I'm, I'm quite proud of how we tested it so where's the overall spoiler alert what did you think of the extender I'm quite surprised that it actually got as far as it did um, it definitely surprised me I'd, I'd love to have one on my fish finders too if I could if I could extend them even more Mm. they are currently doing so yeah no this thing is it's actually uh, it's performed more better than i expected so it says it can do an extension of the of the um of the rating of the max distance <clears throat> from the normal deeper let's say a deeper pro plus or a deeper um Tur plus two it's got a hundred meter limited uh range which is pretty much wi-fi because of the wi-fi it the deeper goes out it's got a Wi-Fi signal that it generates. You don't need data to use it. It generates its own Wi-Fi signal. You connect it to your phone and then you send it out whether you're going to cast it or attach it to your bait boat or um, you're going to send it out with your boat. So it, it usually had a limited range of 100 meters. And then with this guy, it says 200 meters. Now, usually with products, they say 200 meters, but it's usually about 150, 180. How far did we go out with this thing? Surprisingly, we did 240 meters and we still had a bit of signal actually at the end of that um, i ran out of dam <laughs> so we went to the other side of dam <clears throat> and we had 240 meters with his with his um fish finder on as well so we had a lot of interference a lot of interference and it did 240 meters so it worked like a bomb okay so say you tie your deeper to a bait boat just as is without the extender Usually you get a, a, a distance of about 30 meters before the interference kills the deeper signal. Now that's very frustrating and that's why I didn't use my deeper on my previous uh, bait boats even though there was mount to mount and all that stuff. I didn't do it because at 30 meters I'd run out of signal and I want to go further. So with this guy it has done the opposite in terms of it has got the strongest signal with the deeper to the point where we were going 200 meters out the deeper was perfectly connected to um, the extender and my phone 
and then the the remotes to the to the actual boats were starting to interfere when you were standing close to it and then you take five meters step away and then the interference would go away but that tells you how strong the signal is so um quick overall thing i'm very very impressed by the the design of these things it fits onto your tripod nice and easy it holds your phone nice and firm um, it holds the extender nice and and proudly so that you can you can hold it at the right distance uh, from the ground and get a correct signal the um, arm that you connect your deeper to to the boat i've got to be a little bit honest with you so the instructions say clean the surface that you're going to put the sticky velcro thing on then stick it and leave it for 24 hours how many hours did we leave it for Wes? I think four and then we're in the boat we're still kind of wet in between there. So, <laughs> so it held on. We weren't very good. We kind of <clears> tested <throat> it to what you shouldn't do with it and it held on. And the thing is we didn't just attack, attach it to a slow bait boat. Oh, yeah. We attached it to what I consider the best bait boat in the world at the moment. And that thing's pretty much a jet ski with a hopper on it. So with we, we clapped it and it stuck. We didn't need the, the safety uh, harness at all. So I'm very impressed with that design. And then the way it sits in the water holds the deeper at the correct angle. So when we had a side by side comparison of the, the deepers, uh, the deeper and Wesley's um, very, very high end um, bait boat specific uh, sonar, they were reading exactly the same depths at exactly the same times. So I was very impressed with that. And then a the thing I didn't tell Wesley when we were practicing well not practicing when we were testing is when where's reversed it stayed straight it, it allowed you to reverse your bait boat without getting stuff stuck in the prop now if you've tied stuff to the back of your boat before if you reverse you can cut that line like this and mm -hmm. it holds it and makes makes it work very well so um yeah i'm very impressed with it so now like the deeper itself the deeper itself as as a fish finder so we've got mr high end here that he puts inside his boats and all that kind of stuff where's give me give me what you thought of the images that the deeper pro plus like the deeper chirp plus two gave while you were looking side by side with your with your models surprisingly it was it was on par with mine in fact it, it picked up finer details that i didn't expect it to pick up I mean, where mine weren't actually picking up that um so yeah very very surprised because what you're paying for that and what I'm paying for mine, mm. it's, it's, it's worlds apart. And yeah, it's, it's a lot of bang for buck in a little small package there. So I, I was very impressed by the images that came out of it. The one thing that um, where's these boats really shine at, because the, the Camo 360 is pretty much a jet ski with the, with the hopper on it, it's super fast. <clears throat> he can, with his system, can go out and go as fast as he likes and it picks up nice and clear images with the deeper because it's a jack of all trades because you can put it with it and a boat and you can cast it and all those kind of things when the boat picked up a lot of speed the the deeper was pulled underneath the water and then you lost signal so if you if you're pottering along at a normal bait boat speed the deeper does a fantastic job and it and it connects like how fast did it connect about within 10 seconds it was done mm. eh? yeah it was very quick all you got to do turn on your deeper press the on button on your extender Within five seconds, it's connected to it. Then you take your phone and you connect your phone to the range extender, <coughs> not the deeper, the range extender, and you A for away. It is it connected really quickly. So um, I'm very impressed with with the with their system. Um, things I didn't like about it. Um, there are little things that I don't think are too important. Um, the first thing is where's when it was driving back. Tell me what happened. Mm, yeah. So basically. My boat being as high as it is in the water, um, the device is behind the boat and therefore your line of sight is now not there anymore and therefore the, the, the deeper lost connection. But really you're not going to be using it coming back from a target, you're going to be using it going to a target. So it really doesn't matter. So yeah, this, like for me personally it didn't make that much of a deal because usually when you're going out and fishing for stuff, you're looking out, so you're driving away from yourself, so you're driving to your spot and you can find spots on the way or you're driving from left to right or right to right to left you can see you there's a line of sight at all of those angles so it's only when the boat is facing directly towards us and most of the time you've dumped your your rig there anyway and you're on your way back 
and you're not you've done what you wanted to do so that wasn't a big 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 deal breaker and the other the other thing that i thought was was not ideal but it, it, it's it's almost impossible to not have is the interference at distance with remotes and the range extender now the range extender did the opposite of the, just the deeper used it used to be the um, remote used to have a stronger signal and then the deeper would lose connection now the range extender has got the strongest strongest signal and at 200 and something meters we're at 230 or something mm -hmm. then if we put the remotes close together then the remote would start to be um, intermittent but if you just walk five meters away that's a that's a solution um, they then they both work very well and um, yeah I don't know the last thing is I don't know why this guy goes up and down like that that's a bit funny I just think it's unnecessary so yeah guys this thing is fantastic I recommend it to anyone who wants to cast over 110 meters mm. or who wants to use it with a bait boat or needs more connection distance than 100 meters it is absolutely fantastic all of the stuff is quality IPX uh, 67 rated with a 16 hour battery so yeah guys if you want a code to get a discount on deep selected deeper products it might be this or might not be yet but go to the link in the description below and then the deeper uh, discount code should be 10 percent is down there as well if you want to get what i consider the best bait boat in the world not the country in the world the camo 360 make sure to go to carpe diem online online.co.za um, also if you want to get the specimen pro bait boat which i call the ferrari bait boat it looks so damn cool also check it out there and um, there are also a bunch of accessories and gps kits and all those fantastic things that you can automate your boat with with um wesley's site so make sure to check that out and yeah thank you so much for watching till next time tight lines guys tight lines. join us next time on it's tipped up fishing where keaton and wesley fish carp haven and catch something really special as always we'll take you through the rigs and tactics so we'll see you there.